Welcome to Mama Lulu's Kitchen once again. Today's recipe is corned beef taquitos. Let me tell you a little history behind this recipe. When my husband and I got married, he asked me if I could make him corned beef taquitos. And I remember looking at him and saying, what? You cannot put corned beef on a tortilla and make it a taquito. It just doesn't sound right. However, I gave this recipe a try and I absolutely love it. Let's get started. The ingredients for the corned beef tacos are vegetable oil, we have cabbage, we have the corned beef, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and make a guacamole, and for that I need cilantro, avocados, onions, lime, and tomatoes. And then I'm also gonna make a um, pico de gallo, which uh, I'm gonna need onions, serrano peppers, tomatoes, lime, and cilantro, salt to the taste. We have our tortillas here and sour cream. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and um, move on to make our pico de gallo, cilantro, tomatoes, a lime, serranos, and onions, okay? We're gonna go ahead and start with our onion. I think that's enough. Now our tomatoes. We're gonna do our cilantro. peppers and now <clears throat> our lime go ahead and put a little bit of uh, salt to the taste in our lime we're gonna go ahead and add more lime to this We are going to mix. I'm gonna go ahead and cover this. And I'm going to refrigerate until our um, corned beef taquitos are done. Okay, now it's time to make our guacamole. I'm gonna go ahead and chop the uh, cilantro. And our onion. Onions is done. Our tomato. Now it's we're cutting the avocados. We're going to add our lime, salt to the taste, and then we're just going to start mixing. Our 
I think this is done. So I'm just gonna cover this and I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator until our taquitos are done. Look at that. That looks delicious, right? Okay, right here I have my tortilla and I'm gonna go ahead and start rolling our taquitos. Here's our corned beef. And you just put a little bit amount of your corned beef in your tortilla. And um, you start rolling, okay? Roll your roll. Set it aside. And you do the same until you're done with all of your tortillas or until you have as many taquitos as you want. Okay, so now we're ready to start deep frying our taquitos and here's my whole production line. I have um, a strainer over there with paper towels so that I can drain the, the uh, so that the taquitos can drain the excess soil. And there's all my taquitos ready to be deep fried and here's my deep frying pan that I use only for that purpose. So let's get started. Okay, so here I have vegetable oil at a 350 uh, degree temperature for deep frying our tacos. We're going to go ahead and deep fry them for approximately two minutes on each side. These ones are ready to be removed from the oil. And then you repeat the process until you're done with all of your uh, taquitos. Here we have all of our um, taquitos. Look at that, they're all nice and crunchy. So now it's time to assemble our taquitos, prepare our taquitos. So we're gonna go ahead and add some cabbage, some guacamole, de gallo, a little bit more cabbage on the top, some sour cream, and some spicy salsa. 